So the the idea of tradition and lineage um, is is sort of what I'm hearing there, right? Making connections from the now. Where what are some of your lineages that you uh, poetic lineages? Who's your poetic great great grandma, great grandma, grandma? Oh my god! Or father? They they're there too. <laughs> they they're they're all there. Um, yeah, I mean, I like I said, I had a very non-traditional mm -hmm. um, higher education and came to it later in life. Um, so the people who've influenced me, most are more closer to our time. Mm. Um, and it starts, you know, I'll, I'll hear a poem or something that will draw me to them, but then what brings me in deeper is their biography, their history. Who are you? Um, and so Lucille Clifton, um, definitely, I mean, so many of us turn to her, right. her, her her incredible mind, her amazing talent and ability. But for me, it's also husband six kids mm. was working as a secretary for the state. You know, went to grad school, turned around, walked out <laughs> <laughs> because she had these other responsibilities, okay. but the poetry never left her. Um, and she was able to create this incredible body of work in her time mm. that is inspiring to me. Yeah. That is more in line with my experience with the work. Um, so poets like her, um, Sharon Olds, we were talking about yeah. earlier, Sharon Olds, when I feel like um, hiding behind something and not getting to the, mm -hmm. the poem, uh, I go and I read, I read Sharon and then I come back um, to remember what vulnerability looks like mm. and honesty and LePage. Um, Alpha Weaver, Awful Weaver, especially his first book, Talisman. Mm. Talisman, you want to talk about vulnerability. Um, if you've never read that, read it. Okay. Um, but it's so brave and daring. In the poem, the book is broken up into sections named after women in his life, mm. from his mother, his wives, his longtime partners. And while you're reading this, and it's like, oh my God, is this? really who I think it is, and you know you're not supposed to project or assume with the subject, et cetera. You turn to the back and there is a notes on each of these women in his life. Um, and it gave me great permission to not hide from my truth, mm. knowing that there will be other people in the world who might not exactly like that you're writing about your truth, because it's theirs as well. But you should never be silenced, and you mm. should be free to write your story.